Good evening and thanks for joining us. Our top story tonight, while Democrats are disappointed in the national races, here in Bend, they swept both state races. Including flipping Bend's state Senate from red to blue. Let's take a look at the latest ballot returns for Bend State Senate seat District 27. Bend City Councilor Anthony Broadman is leading businessman Michael Summers 59% to 41%. And Democrat Emerson Levy is leading in her campaign to keep representing Bend in Oregon's House of Representatives. You can see the returns showing her leading 54% to 46%. Tonight, new at 6, Kelsey McGee speaks with both campaigns about the road ahead. Democrats won two closely watched Bend races Tuesday night. Representative Emerson Levy defeated Carrie Lopez to a second term in Salem. I am just so looking forward to go, going back to Salem. We have so many, so much big work to do, so many bills to write, and I'm just honored to have the trust of the community. Lopez conceded to Levy Tuesday night. Levy says she's going to continue working in a bipartisan fashion, reaching across the aisle to get tasks completed. I'll continue to serve on housing and work on energy policy and water policy. As for Bend attorney and city councilor Anthony Broadman, he defeated Redmond businessman Michael Summers. Broadman has more than 47,000 votes to nearly 33,000 for Summers. I think we brought together Republicans and Democrats and independents from across Redmond and sisters in Deschutes County. Broadman believes Deschutes County is ready for a change. And hopefully tonight signals an end to legislative walkouts uh, for good and a focus on practical good government. We reached out to both of their opponents asking for an interview and did not hear back. Kelsey McGee, News Channel 21.